I don't really want to go into the open here. My whole team is playing very aggressively. I haven't got the opportunity for any shots so far. Just one hit a bat chat. <laughs> just one hit that bat chat. Oh, it's like, oh, it's bat chat. Dead. One hit. 1,800 damage on that bat chat. Are you serious? My God. Just balanced. Why should this be? F I don't think this is fair. Like, I'm going to get one of these, but you know me, I don't have a problem with playing overpowered tanks, but like... I don't know, this this game is just turning into... It's like almost, almost like Counter-Strike or Call of Duty now, like... It's like headshot, you're dead, you know? Enemy armor is destroyed. I mean, because I was firing Hesh there, I knew that I had the flexibility to just fire when I knew the shot wouldn't have penetrated anyway. Because I knew it was going to splash on him and do like 400 damage anyway. So, my god, it's crazy. This is quite weird. I'm not sure what I think of this gun at the moment. Let's just fire a Hesh Hammer straight into the middle of him. And it goes in! Troll! Okay. Just totally troll him for 1,500 health. I just fired at the middle of his tank with Hesh. Oh my god. Total, total trollage. Da 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 bum 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 <laughs> so stupid <laughs> Oh Oh man I'm getting this tank just for the pure trolls my god I'm gonna spend all of my credits on her shamo and just troll Just so troll Okay. I play two. <laughs> I play. I play FV two one five B. Ridiculous tank. Why? Why? Why should I do five thousand three hundred damage for four shots? <laughs> Mental. So we hit that bat chap once, and he died for one thousand eight hundred. We hit this guy for one thousand six hundred. We hit this guy for one thousand five hundred. We hit this guy, we finished him off with a splash damage for 341. Mental tank. I'm going to probably look at the stats of this now, just to, just to try and judge, because it's just crazy. So it's got normal-ish kind of health. It's quite fast, like it's got 800 brake horsepower but only weighs 60 tons. With a 34 km, km an hour top speed limit. Great traverse speed of 32 for a tank destroyer. Excellent frontal armor of 256. Both on the turret and awful side armor on the turret, though. So if you even get this kind of an angle, you should be able to just bang there and it should go in. The rate of fire is two rounds a minute. When we compare that to an E100 Jagdpanzer, though, what's the rate of fire of an E100 Jag? Oh, that's not the Jagdpanzer. An E100 Jagdpanzer is 2.33. So. That's, like, balanced when you consider the AP ammo. But the thing is, is that we're not firing AP ammo, are we? We're firing this beautiful stuff. It's beautiful. High explosive. Hesh ammo, my god. A 
total damage of 2188 can be done with this tank. And even if you don't penetrate the tank, it just splashes and does like 600 to 700, maybe even higher. Pretty crazy. The fact that this thing can only carry 12 shells, I guess, means that it's limited to 10,000 damage a game if it pens all of its shots. You don't want to waste your shells on this, though. This is a very powerful tank. If it stays like this, then I'm definitely going to grind for one. Um, what I think they will do, I'm, I'm calling it now, they're going to reduce the... They'll reduce the average damage of Hesh to 1,500, firstly. They'll just reduce this. If they don't do that, then they're going to reduce the penetration to like like 200-ish. When we consider the o one of the only other tanks in the game that can use Hesh ammo, it might even be the only other tank in the game that can use Hesh ammo, it's the 4202. Yeah? Here's the Hesh ammo on the 4202. So it does an extra... It does an extra 100... Um, sorry, 90 damage compared to the 390. And it has 50 less penetration, so 268 is going to 210. When we consider this bad boy, it's doing like half, nearly half extra. Well, fair enough, it's not half, but 600 extra. It is half, it is half. It's doing an extra half damage, but it only loses the 35 millimeters of penetration. So 275 with Hesh, fair enough, it won't get normalization rolls of the armor piercing shells. Which means if you're firing at angled targets, this thing can be pretty brutal to penetrate with your Hesh. But still, flat surfaces, 275 is more than enough to just brutalize through the armor. And the 1750, that's crazy. I don't think you'd ever fire an HE shell in this tank. Never. Like, I can't think of a reason why you would ever fire an HE shell in this tank. Unless you're credit poor and you want to just fire 2000 shells rather than the 5600. But still, you'll make your money back. Well, you won't. I mean, actually, it's tier 10, so it's going to be a money sink. But just play your, play some of your lower tier tanks to make your money back and have some fun. It's an absolute beast. Frontal beast. Huge artillery target, though, to be fair. Really tall tank as well. So up close, maybe some tanks will be able to deal with it having a low profile and this tank won't be able to get the easy penetrating shots on their side and their front the angles I don't know it's very interesting all right let's troll some more just gonna keep trolling until mr. jingles can get online